The critical issue in this study really is the student. Over the last decades, we've seen an alarming increase in the incidence of depression, anxiety, other mental health problems, substance use, and sort of uh, experiences of stress among the nation's college students. The three major crises that the country is experiencing at the moment, the COVID epidemic and the accompanying economic problems, the recognition of the need to address the racial injustice that's long been pervasive in this country are exacerbating actually the need to deal with the with these problems and deal with them now. Every institution has an environment that characterizes it. And what we are asking is that institutions look at themselves and ask whether there are things in their environment that contribute to the stresses and mental health problems that students are experiencing. We are well aware that this is a terrible time financially for academic institutions, but it's essential that they address this problem or their problems will only be compounded. For example, when students are experiencing emotional problems, often they drop out of school. The first step for any institution solving any kind of problem is they need to do an assessment of how's the mental health of their students. How is the environment that they have helping or hindering the success of their students? What an institution needs is to evaluate what its capacity is to help, what they might have to rely on in the broader community, or what they might have to use telehealth to help solve. But every institution has to look at its own capacity to provide the services that its students need. Historically, institutions relied just on their counseling services or their student health services to provide the help that students need. The truth is, there's a role for everybody on campus. We could very simply train every faculty and staff member to be able to respond productively when a student says, I need help. The success of students in academia in their higher education is of critical importance not only to them, but to the institutions and to the broader society that needs a well-educated workforce to deal with the many problems that it faces. Our concern is to make sure that the next generation of students can thrive as fully as possible. <laughs>